Hello, this is David Taylor at Web Media in Chester. And in this video, I want to talk uh, briefly about briefing clients using video and YouTube. Now, this is a technique that uh, we've been using for a couple of years now, and um, it's very well received by customers. And we basically use video to walk them through uh, our thinking in terms of what we're designing on a new project and why we are doing certain things and what the, they aim to achieve. And we find this much more effective than just um, either sending them the, um, the visual to look at with no explanation or indeed sending them something with a, um, a text document or a Word document attached that they have to read and then refer back to uh, the, the visual or the project work that we have sent with it. So what happens by using video? Um, it's such an engaging medium uh, and it really communicates um, sometimes quite complicated issues very effectively and very quickly and uh, makes it far easier and quicker for the client to understand what it is that we're talking about. Um, now you're watching right now an example of the, the kind of technology that we use to do this. Uh, it's really very simple. But um, if, for example, uh, we were walking a client through uh, this particular website, which is our own, we would be able to highlight ar areas of text uh, like so uh, to bring uh, particular emphasis to, to issues. Also, as you can see, the, the cursor, the mouse cursor is visible in the video. And so you can point out various elements on the screen uh, as you move through. And um, if you want to be even more specific, you can increase the, the browser magnification in order to zoom in on a particular area of the screen, like so. And it makes it all very easy to follow. Now, what we use to capture the video and audio is actually a free piece of software this one called a tube catcher and um, uh, there are no nasty um, attachments to it embedded in it uh, we've been using it for a long time uh, there are some options to download other items with it but um, you don't have to do that uh, but essentially it is free and it is very easy to use so if I just bring it up once it's installed this is what it looks like and it has a number of different uh, uses but the the use that I'm I'm showing today is this tab screen record and what it'll let you do is is to uh, using this select area button you can actually select which area of the screen you want to record in the video uh, so you can just record a portion of the screen or the whole screen as I'm doing now and you have some other options such as delaying the start of the video uh, which I've done and recording the cursor which um, is also uh, being done in this video so that's that's what it does and it also captures the audio of course using a very simple microphone that plugs directly into um, your PC unless you have a built-in mic on your laptop of course uh, which uh, which will all work seamlessly together and so once you have uh, created your video using the screen capture from a tube catcher and you stop the video what you do then is you go over to your youtube account and you click on the upload button and then you simply drag your video from your desktop across into the upload and um, what's important to remember when you do this is to set the video to unlisted because the default view is public and usually these are confidential videos and you don't want them to be publicly available on YouTube so you just change the setting from public to unlisted and then it is not uh, searchable it's not found in search results and it is only available to you when you are logged in but you can send a link from the video once it's uploaded to your client 
and they will be able to view uh, that video uh, but it, it isn't found in the general uh, search results on YouTube so um, that is how we use this uh, this free piece of software uh, we have consistently found uh, that clients say that it is really a very useful um, and effective way of briefing them when you can't do it face to face um, you might have an initial meeting but then you want to be uh, updating them or discussing issues or is illustrating issues for discussion using video and uh, I'm pretty confident that this kind of technology and this approach could be applied for up to a whole range of different business types where you want to illustrate something on screen be it video or photography or um, many other uh, uh, opportunities and uh, examples so there you are I hope that that helps you to brief your clients more effectively in the future and um, we look forward to seeing you on the next video